The relationship between humanity and God has to do with his word, keeping his word, speaking all creation into existence with his word. The covenant relationship initiated by God to go more than the extra mile is the foundation of why we have the hope of heaven before us. Indeed, Jesus didn't just meet us halfway, but came the full distance to the cross to do for us what we couldn't do for ourselves, because the truth was no longer in us. In the beginning, when he created us through the heritage of our ancestry, there was perfection of thought and perfection of motive in us. But because evil was introduced to us and we allowed sin to enter through through us as a race of beings originally created in God's image, we abandoned God's truth for the devil's lie. Surely you shall not die if you eat of the fruit, for God knows that your eyes will be opened and you will be like God. Can you feel the breath of the serpent on your neck as he seduces you into his web of deceit that turns everything upside down, making his way seem like the right way and God's way seem somehow wrong? Do you have enough of God's truth through his word in you to fight off the onslaught of propaganda that washes over you until you're drowning in a sea of doubt about what you thought you knew? Is the enemy trying to twist the truth until it's so distorted it can't be recognized as absolute any longer? I encourage you to not allow your mind to drift into the land of relativity where there's no measuring rod of righteousness.